He is still there and tucked down in there with the dough. So I'm going to go see if this works. Yeah. Holy crap, it worked again. Oh. I can't believe that worked again, that's awesome. Well, just getting all dressed up here. I'm gonna hunt my driveway again today. It is November 1st here in Michigan. Just got back from a whitetail trip down to Veracruz, was able to take a Gulf Coast whitetail and an Axis deer and a white lift peccary. Literally got back late last night. I know from everybody around here, the deer have been chasing. I've been watching on my trail cams. It's been an active couple of days. I've got this deer on my driveway that I've literally been watching since last year. He shows up every couple of days. Gonna get finished loading up here and off we go. We'll have about three hours to sit in the stand tonight. I want to try to do a deer with my bow, crossbow, rifle and muzzleloader this year. I already got a Colombian whitetail with my muzzleloader, so I'm gonna switch it up. I'm gonna try using the old Mission Point crossbow here. Switching it up, got several broadheads on it. Pretty sweet setup, I won't lie. So off we go. Well, I kind of got in the habit of checking my trail cams before heading to the stand, just to see if I was gonna switch where I was gonna sit. And of course, 3.30, that big deer decides to come in early. He's there with a the doe right now. Hadn't been there in two days. So I am crazy. So I'm gonna do a drive-by. Literally, actually where I park is where I'm gonna drive by and see if I can't see him. Um, if he's there, he's in a bowl. Why not? We'll try a spot in stock for year two. If you guys remember a couple years ago, I already did this little routine and it worked out. Um, and then earlier this year, I was over at my buddy's Kevin's and he actually did the, did the same thing. So one of the benefits of using a crossbow, it makes it a heck of a lot easier problem is I don't have the right cameras and I am not going to wait to go because I don't know how long he's going to be there and if it doesn't work out I'm gonna back out probably never see this hopefully he comes back tonight but we're gonna go cruise and see He is still there and tucked down in there with a the doe. And how this food plot lays is it's right in a bowl. And I literally parked just on the other side of the building where I normally don't park, but I'm out of sight. So I'm going to go and see if this works. I just got my safety vest off. Got the crossbow loaded up. The problem is I don't really have anywhere to film it. I took the attachment off my regular camera. I'm gonna see if I can't set it on the ground somewhere. Of course, I don't have a tripod either. We're off we go. The wind is perfect. Those leaves are not though. right now the wind is perfect blowing away literally if I crawl and make it to that that corner right there I'm gonna get a shot at him
Holy crap, it worked again. Oh, I'm literally laying in a deer scrape right here. The smell of deer urine is extremely high on me. I was able to sneak up this right here. God, and he is less than 42. I used the 40 pin, it looked a tad high, but he, he is gone. I had to raise up. The first time I raised up, there was this brush right in the way, so I had to scoot down a little bit more to get a clearing to be able to shoot. And he was facing right. He took off, he mule kicked, went that way. I can't believe that worked again, that's awesome. All right. We'll back up and give him some time. The does took off to the left, he took off to the right. All right, just got back to the truck, picked up the other camera. Oh, I'm not sure what you could see, what you couldn't see. It doesn't matter though, because that is a big deer. And that is the second deer in my life I was able to spot and stalk with a crossbow, both on my driveway. I've been watching this deer. I actually saw this deer last fall. I watched them all through season on trail cam. And I shot that big buck on my driveway with my rifle the 16th. And this guy last year was in this food plot and I've got some grainy cell phone footage I'm gonna show here. But I filmed him on my driveway in this same exact food plot, ironically about 70 yards away from where I ended up shooting him right now. And obviously he's a year bigger. He's He's a big deer. I've been watching him. I say my first trail cam picks were in August. He comes and goes and man, but it's happening right now. Does are all over the place on my place because we did an extreme cutting here. It would have been six years ago. So the undergrowth is, is fierce. Man, I'm not gonna lie to you. I crawled through two deer scrapes along the woods there and I smell like deer piss bad, but it doesn't matter. All right, right in here. Roughly where I shot. Ooh. If you can see it, we got, got some hair. And then I saw him, he jumped off this way. I'm pretty sure he stayed on that trail. Ooh. And if you can see it. We have got the arrow. She is covered. The old sever. Looks like it did the job. Starting to open up now. Get the spray. Get the spray. Oh boy. Oh yeah. Look at this. Oh, there he is. There he is. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. You guys are not going to believe this. Look at this freaking deer oh my goodness oh my goodness oh my goodness this deer is an absolute toad look at that i knew it was a little bit forward oh but that just crushed him look at the blades on his g2s and his mass. That is, oh my goodness. This deer, I've seen this deer, this is the second year. I thought he was three and a half last year. I think he's four and a half this year, but I'm gonna send off his, his 
teeth just to make sure but a absolute slob of a Michigan whitetail. West Michigan whitetail, that is. Oh, all right, I gotta go get my phone. Text dad. So I'm gonna need somebody to come out and take pics. Oh my goodness. Look at this guy. Oh. Here he is. I've been watching this deer on my driveway for two years now, and I still can't believe that worked. And 42 yards, this guy was standing, had to wait a second for him to clear some brush and let him go. I hit him a little bit far forward, but that sever, man, did some damage. Just an awesome West Michigan deer here. Big bodied, chasing does, November 1st, right here. Another driveway buck. I can't call this one driveway buck. I already got that one done, but awesome deer. I just hope that footage worked out semi-decent, but even if it didn't, it doesn't matter because I got this deer in my hands. <laughs>